When you make your pen drive bootable for installing Windows, Linux, or any other system, you'll find that you can't use it anymore for normal file storage. If that happens, don't worry. Just follow these simple steps to turn it back into a regular USB drive you can use for any purpose. Click the Windows Start button, type CMD, and you'll see Command Prompt. Right-click on Command Prompt and choose Run as Administrator. This is important. Without admin rights, the steps won't work. Now that the Command Prompt is open, we'll start Disk Part by typing Disk Part. Press Enter. After a second, you'll see the Disk Part prompt. This means Disk Part is ready for commands. Next, type List Disk Command to list all disks connected to your computer. Press Enter and you'll see a list like this. Usually, disk zero is your main hard drive. Look for the disk that matches your USB size. Disk one is my 16 gigabytes pen drive. Now, we'll select the USB by typing this command, replacing X with your USB's disk number. In my case, it's disk one. Disk part will confirm by saying disk one is now the selected disk. That's exactly what we want. Here's where we wipe the drive's partition table. Type clean. Press enter. This command instantly deletes all partitions on the selected disk. It doesn't take long. You'll see a message. Disk part succeeded in cleaning the disk. Now let's create a fresh partition that Windows can recognize. Type create partition primary. Hit enter. Disk part will confirm the primary partition was created successfully. Next, we'll format the partition so it works like a normal USB. I recommend using FAT3 to 4 compatibility, but you can also use XFAT if your files are bigger than 4 GB. To format with FAT3 to quickly, type format FS equals FAT30 to quick. Press Enter. This might take a few seconds, but you'll see the progress in disk part. After formatting, we need to give the USB a drive letter, so it shows up in File Explorer. Type. Disk part will confirm by saying something like, Disk part successfully assigned the drive letter or mount point. Your pen drive should now pop up automatically. Finally, we can leave disk part. Type exit. Now, see your USB drive. It can be used for any purpose, like storing files, videos, or documents just like a normal pen drive. Lastly, close the command prompt window. That's it, your pen drive is now a normal USB storage device again.